Hey, good morning, everyone. This is Stan Craig. I'm happy to have a chance to chat with you again. I enjoyed being with you at the conventions and the meetings that we've been having lately. It's been a delight to meet many of you both. Uh, Mark and I are very appreciative. Uh, today is a very special program. I want to introduce to you a new product that you can offer to clients. This product will help you speak to people you've never spoken to before. It'll allow you to go back to people you previously discussed. And by the way, as a salesperson, you never get rid of a prospect. Never lay aside a prospect. Always keep that person in your book because there's always a new reason to call. And this is a new reason to call people you've previously spoken to who you may want to discuss this with. They can be a parent or a grandparent and you want to discuss this. It's an easy discussion and an easy sale. So first, let me just tell you a thank you, a big thank you. Uh, I'm gonna cover that first and then we're gonna announce the net student because that's really a, a product that you're gonna love for lots of reasons. So thank you so much. Mark and, and all of us are so grateful for having the time to spend with you and, and for all the things you've done. And then we wanna be sure that we announce um, this marvelous new product. So the thank you is this. All of us who met you recently, Mark, who many of you know so well over the years, Daryl, uh, who's terrific and was very helpful at all of our, our meetings. Todd, who's our new guy, kind of like me, but maybe a little newer. Eddie, new guy, kind of like me, maybe a little newer. And then Jamie and I, we were happy to visit with you and hearing every one of your comment and every suggestion. And we take them all to heart. We wrote them down and we're working on it. And I trust you got the message from us. Know you, know me. Let me tell you what that means. That means that you work for us, right? Wrong. Listen, we work for you. It's not the other way around. If you are not there marketing the net law products, then there's no reason for us to be here. We know who we work for and we work for you. All of us at the desk, uh, Vanessa, I'm sure Mary, uh, everyone is there to help. And we want to, you to know that we care about what you're doing. Jennifer, uh, again, there to help, and we wanna take your calls, and your calls from your clients, because the truth is, we know, know you, if you're not there, know me. That's important for us. We, we understand the importance of what you do for us every day. And that's part of the reason for putting these webinars together every week. They, they take some time, they take some attention, but it's our goal to serve you. So. You probably heard those old stories, good news and bad news. I thought this one was really funny. I have some good news and some bad news. We've heard those old jokes. What's the bad news, says the accused, after the attorney tells them good news and bad news. The bad news is your blood's all over the crime scene, and the DNA tests prove you did it. Well, then what's the good news? Uh, your cholesterol is 130. <laughs> you know, if you understand what we're talking about, it is funny. The bad news is, yes, you're going to jail. The good news is, because we tested all your blood, you have low cholesterol. Be happy as you head off to jail. You know, uh, these old jokes have been around forever. Good news, bad news. So I have some good news and bad news. Our big announcement, our new product offer, is a good news, bad news thing. We're gonna talk about the good news first, and then we're gonna talk about the bad news. It, why is it a big announcement? It's a big announcement because this is the first time anyone to our knowledge has ever offered this product. We believe net law in itself is unique, but this is really unique. No one is offering this brand new product called net student. So let's talk about it. Here's the good news. Your child made it to 18. Wow. Isn't that great? <laughs> I'm telling you when our kids got to be grown up, and 18, they got to be gone. Gloria and I have six children. You've heard me say before, we had a quiet, inexpensive hobby that got totally out of hand and six kids. You know, we had to do a lot of work with six kids, but we were grateful when they grew up and moved away. We had bounce back kids who came back, but thankfully they're all doing well and, and away. So good news, your child made it to 18. I mean, you know, sometimes we wish birth control was retroactive, right? 
birth control retroactive would change a lot of things. But our kids surviving and us surviving our kids really important. That's really good news. But here's the bad news. Let me alarm you because when your child turns 18, there are some things that happen. And this is what I want you to know. When your child turns 18, he or she is considered an adult by law, which means that they are now under the law an adult. In every way, the courts sees your children as an adult. An adult can be as immature as a baby goat. <laughs> nah, 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 running into everything and bumping into everybody and butting heads with everybody. They can be as immature as a baby goat, but he or she is legally an adult. Don't you wish you became adult by behavior? I mean, then some of our kids at 13, 14, or 15, we'd declare an adult. Some at 35, you know, that's the way it works. But according to law, birthdays define maturity, so they are an adult. What that means is whether they're at home, at work, traveling, or at school, they could still live at home, of course. They can be away at work. They can be on the road somewhere or at school. They are covered. You know, part of us want to say, thank you so much. They moved out, but you're no longer able to speak for them or get information on their condition if they are hospitalized or if they are unconscious, no recognized voice to express their wishes. You know, Thank you, Lord, the kids grew up and they are gone. I'm so glad. But here's the problem. If they have to go to the hospital for any reason, and you know, unfortunately, sometimes kids, adults who are 18 and over, eat, drink, or swallow something that they shouldn't. Sometimes there is a car accident, a bicycle accident. Sometimes they may slip and fall out of a dormitory window or injure themselves in sports. Sometimes they may be at work and have a problem and get injured. And worse, if it's a head injury, you can't speak for them. Not only that, you can't get information from the hospital because you are not registered as a HIPAA authority under the health uh, information and Patient Protection Act. That means you can't get information. No matter, you can call the university if they call and say your son's in the hospital, uh, your daughter's been injured. You can't get detailed information unless your child is signed a HIPAA authority or you show them that you are in fact who you say you are by facts. Most of us don't want to do that. But how do you, how do you get the information? And worse, if they're unconscious, who says what should be done? And even worse, if they remain unconscious, if they're severely injured in a coma or another reason to be unconscious for a period of time. You know, living wills were created simply because of three young women who were injured and were in lengthy, lengthy comas. Listen, all of our children run at risk. Everyone does. We know that. But we are no longer the parent who can speak for them and learn about them unless we take care of the documents. What? Wait a minute. I spoke to many of you at the conventions that we've attended and meetings. You said, what? Wait a minute. I'm paying the health insurance. Listen, do you think that makes any difference whether they have or don't have insurance or who pays for it? No. Well, but wait a minute. They're still under my roof. Makes no difference. Makes no difference. Here's the reason. At 18, every child becomes an adult. Remember, dumb as a baby goat, crazy as a baby goat, makes no difference. Independent adults means the parents are not recognized as the legal guardian anymore. Not recognized. It means you're not recognized as the power of attorney. You do not get to speak for that at this point. It also means you're not recognized as the HIPAA authority. Neither you nor your spouse nor anyone else in the family, the grandparent who is raising the child or the aunt who is raising the child, no one else is recognized as the authority to speak and get information about that child when they become adult. It means you're not recognized for financial information. That's 
important if they're at college or school because you can't get information from the university about their grades or about their financial relationship with the school. They may not have paid any tuition, may not have paid any fees, may be behind in everything. You can't get the information unless you get the documents because you have no right to receive grades or school records without a net student package. None. What? <laughs> yeah, that's the truth. It's, it's there all the time. It's been there all the time. We've just never talked about it. Parents don't talk about it. I guarantee you, your students say, oh, mom and dad, I want you to get all the information about me in case I have a problem. But you need to know, you need to have these documents done. And now's the time to get the new adult to sign the documents, especially if they're still at home, to get the new adult to sign the documents, especially if they're away at school, to get this adult and remember, if you haven't done this, I spoke to one of you again and said, my daughter is away. She lives in Seattle. Gosh, I need to get this done for her. It doesn't matter their age. Every adult over 18, let me say this, every adult over 18, every adult, 18, 20, 25, 35, 45, 50, or older needs to have the net student package to authorize someone to speak for them. We call it net student here, but we call it net law MD in other areas because these are the medical documents that everyone needs to have because every one of us is going to go to the hospital at some time. You know, we all think they have the rights. We have the rights. We're going to get information, but you're not. We all think we as parents can tell what we think should happen. No, you can share it with a student if they're conscious, share it with your family member if they're conscious, but if they're not, you have great difficulty here. Everyone needs to have this done. We're talking about as students, but the truth is everyone you speak to needs to have these documents for their own peace of mind and for their family. This is a part of, as you know, the net law MD package is a part of the net law estate plan but now you can sell only the medical part. That's the big announcement. What does that mean? It's a durable power of attorney for healthcare and finance. It's a living will declaration, of course, and it's FERPA for students. So there's two documents, power of attorney for healthcare, power of attorney for finance. And I've said to you so many times that my wife and I are each others, but for our alternate, we have our son. Remember, I. You probably don't, but I do. When we lived in Kentucky, it was one child. Now we live in Florida, we've changed it to others who are our durable powers attorney as alternates. The living will, what we want and don't want, what you want your child to have or not want. And FERPA is the, um, the Educational Reporting Act, which gives privacy, privacy to the student. You can get them to sign the document so you can get grades. And so you can get the financial relationship with the school. That's an important document. That's part of the net student package. Now, if your child is not a student, you don't need FERPA, but you still need all the other things. That's the net law MD package. Right now, we're calling it net student. So it's important that everyone has these documents. If you're not, if anyone is not a college student, you don't need FERPA, but they all need the package. So how does this work? Why do you want it and how does it work? Well, here's the basic thing. It is an agent commission to you for selling it. It is an agent commission. So you get paid for marketing this little portion of a net law estate package as a package by itself. You get paid for it, which is a good deal. It's an account opener because most everyone has not heard about this because these documents have not been marketed separately by anyone. Most parents have never heard of this. It's also a reason to call because no one knows about it until they have to, and that's a tragedy. A car accident that sends a child to the hospital who's unconscious when they get there. If, they, if a parent gets that call, that is terrifying because you can't speak. And if they live in another state, outside of your influence, even outside of your ability to visit or contact, it's even more sad for the parents. You need to get this done now. And the reason is it's a new account with a built-in question. When you talk to your anybody, your acquaintances who have kids over 18, 
your parents and grandparents who have students, uh, children, 18 and above, who they want to get information on, have you completed these documents for yourself? Is a natural extension of talking about net law students, a natural extension. So everyone could be a prospect. That's the reason when I said this at the beginning, you can offer this to everyone and everyone is a prospect. Never give up. This is a chance to be on the phone, to be in front of people, PTA groups, church groups, other groups that really allow you to talk about something that's really important. And the nice thing about it is this will add a lot to the business you're currently doing. If you have already been marketing net law, just go back and add this on the net law package for students. Because remember, you got this done, all these legal documents in the medical realm when they opened their net law state plan. By the way, good time to go back and say, have you updated yours? Hopefully you've got your plan done. This is so important. We don't want to sell documents we don't deliver, right? It's really important. And then all your prospects and all your acquaintances who have children over 18 at college, those working where they live at home or away, they need to know about this. They need to know how important it is to be able to get information if they want. Now, here's the best thing about it. What does it cost? Mm, $99. Yeah, $99, which is a wonderful, inexpensive way to open new accounts for $99. Mark's going to talk about that. I'm so glad to have Mark as our partner. I'm so glad to have Mark as a friend and, and for us together to do the best we can to serve you. But Mark and Vanessa, Mary and Jennifer, uh, all of us, Todd, Jamie, everyone I mentioned earlier, Eddie and Daryl, we want to help because this is a perfect introduction to net law, a perfect way to market our products, and an outstanding way to talk to new people and open new accounts, net student. And Mark's going to walk you through the steps now. He's going to explain how it works. He's going to explain what the $99 covers. He's going to talk about the real values of this and how to implement it into your business. So Mark, thank you so much for being a part of what we do every day, Mark. You know how much I appreciate you and the team. It's, I'm just proud to be a little part of what you do every day. And then if you have questions, the best thing about these is that you have a chance to ask questions. Is it available in every state? Mark will cover that. How's the $99 work? Mark will tell you that. He is, uh, he's our resident expert on all things net law. So Mark, thank you so much. I really appreciate what you do. And I'm excited that we get to offer this to our net law family. I'm excited about this. And if you've never done net law, you've never registered, you know, you get to buy one, get one free. There's all kinds of benefits for you that Mark talks about. If you have people on your team, people you're recruiting, who have never done this. Remember, you don't have a license to sell any of these. You really ought to get them involved. This is the perfect, easiest sale ever for a $99 introduction to what we do. Mark, I'm sorry. I'll shut up and let you talk about it because you're as excited about it as I am. Thank you so much, Mark.